you guys believe in ghosts? <laughs> it's kind of creepy. How'd it go in there? Good. I met a friend. You did? So we are headed to Fort Pickens. And what was Fort Pickens known for? <laughs> it was one of the three major forts that protected the city of Pensacola back in the Civil War. Located 10 miles from Pensacola Beach on the Gulf Shores of Florida, the undeveloped pure white sandy beaches are protected by the Gulf Island National Seashore. The grounds have a discovery center, picnic pavilion, campground, and more. There is a daily guided tour that lasts about 45 minutes, but we opted for the self-guide tour to roam the halls ourselves. So you have the three points here. You have Fort Brank is here, which is where the uh, Navy base is right now, currently. So it's on, this is where the base is. Then you have Fort McRae over here. And this is Fort Pickens, where we are. So the reason they did this is they had three defenses as people were coming in to the bay here so they could bombard the ships from all sides that way. As soon as you enter the grounds of the fort, you immediately feel an eeriness in the air because of the history. The way I understand it is the column is a mountain going, and you see the track here. So it would have been a mountain going. Oh yeah, Larry, what are they called again? That's right, we learned that before. Because they hang tight to the sea That's true. <laughs> Fort Pickens was the largest of the forts of the U.S. government built to protect Pensacola Bay and the Navy Yard. Isn't this crazy? It's like you're touching something that's been here for hundreds of years. It's wild. Do you think this is like where they kept a bunch of like the cannonballs? Yeah. Roaming these halls, you can feel the history. But of course I needed a photo. or something, I don't know. They probably kept it down here in case it caught on fire. Wow. Very interesting. I would say that's where they kept the explosives, gunpowder maybe, in case it caught on fire. If you like our content, please like and subscribe. This is one of the largest cannons ever developed. Yet, interestingly enough, this was never fired. The cannon weighs about 50,000 pounds and it can shoot up to three miles.
somewhere here. See how the point comes all the way out. The side of Fort McCrim. It's going to be right there. Okay. That direction? That direction. There's the Pensacola Lighthouse. Oh, yeah. You can see it it's still going around a little. Thank you for following along on our tour of Fort Pickens. Do you think it's haunted with history? Always remember I love you.